Hey everybody, what is going on? I hope you guys are all doing well and welcome to another tutorial video. In this video, I'm going to be explaining to you guys how to create a WBS or a work breakdown structure in Asana. So let's get right into it. Now a work breakdown structure is in essence just a list or a document or whatever you want it to be, which is a well document that breaks down the work structure and how it's supposed to look like what the project's supposed to look like, who's going to, uh, who's supposed to do which tasks, uh, which major deliverables are done through which tasks, etc., etc. Now, to create one in Asana, what you want to do, and as you can see, I'm in Home, uh, you're going to want to scroll down until you get to Projects and then click Create New Project. I'm just going to select a blank one, and here you need to select a name. I'll just make a tutorial WBS project and here you can create a list a board a timeline a calendar you can use whichever one you find most fitting for your project i'm just going to select a list you can also select the privacy of your project which is uh, private to members or to the workspace you're currently in once you're done just create a project and in my case it is a list which looks like this and as you can see here you need to put in the task names the assignees the due date, etc., and you can add other sections if you want to. You can also click here to add a new section. For example, this is where you'll be making your deliverables. So, for example, let me name this section deliverable one. That's the first section, and now you can collapse it or expand it. You can also create a second one. Let's say deliverable two. And once that's done, now you need to select one of them and then click Add Task. Here you can say Task 1, Task 2, Task 3, and that is an example of that. Then go to Assignees and click whoever you want. I'll just click myself since I'm the only one in this here uh, well project. Then you need to select a due date. I'll select, I don't know, the 11th of September. Uh, completely randomly and then I'll just add a new field for example let's say budget and you can add a number and this can be a number with decimals without decimals I'll just write it up to two decimals you can use percents you can use currencies for example I'll use euros as you can see this is what it would look like you get a pretty nice preview here you can also add a description then click create field and here you just enter whatever you want let's say 2,500 euros and as you can see you have a sum over here and that's pretty much the basics of creating AWBS in Asana. Hope you guys enjoyed and I'll be seeing you guys in another video.